All right, guys, welcome back to me trying to do a YouTube Minecraft survival let's play. I did not record an intro, so I'm all over the place. I'm about to start a build on the starter house over here. Um, this is where it's going to be where I'm standing. <laughs> I just realized I probably should move this stuff. But uh, between episodes, I did a bit of caving. I lit up that cave over there. Uh, that, that I was dying in all the time. I kind of want to forget that episode even exists. Uh, it was kind of uh, embarrassing dying so much. <laughs> it's so simple. But uh, I I put together a neat little time lapse of me caving and what else I did between episodes. So enjoy. Now that you're all caught up with that, I got to go find some spruce trees because spruce trees are life. And if you ain't on that train, well, better get on it because it's the best wood out there. Just uh, traveling on an ocean because that's what I wanted to do. It's the easiest way for me to travel, cover a lot of land. We'll see how this goes. Look for anything in the water. While we're at it. We're nowhere near trying to get a monument, but it's good to know where it is. Are those the trees we want? Or is that not? No. Okay. Still rowing. See you in a few. Oh, don't mind if I do. Sweet. I love these shipwrecks. Makes it easier. Ooh, fire protection. Boss blocks. That's what I like to see. Some carrots. Gunpowder stew. I'll take it all. Nah, I won't take it all. Take most of it. Just kidding. It looks like we're here at the spruce forest already. It didn't take too long. All right, get some trees and get out of here. Oh, baby, it's more coal. Let's go. Coal for days. It just does not stop. Still in that same vein. I swear there's a method to my madness here. I need to smelt a lot of stone. Need a lot of smooth stone, need a lot of bricks. Or stone bricks. So, this is what I'm doing now. This is my life. Give me that. Wee, kelp. Magic kelp decided to give itself up for me. I'll make a farm out of that eventually. Use it for fuel and a smelter. Get that going automatically at some point. My good people of Orange Roof Town Land Berg. I have returned with the spruce. You will not be getting of it, any of it, because uh, y'all suck. 
Okay, bye. Five emeralds for a birch sapling that you probably picked up off the ground from over there. You want to explain yourself? Huh? Freaking scam me again. You and your llamas can go hug a cactus or something. Give me your letter. So, this is where I'm going to start building my village town starter house thing. We got a nice donkey over there. We got some horses somewhere. Probably down off this cliff. Our mountain that we started at is right there. And then the good people of Orange Rooftown Landberg, or whatever I called it the second ago, they're just over yonder. They don't know it yet, but uh, I'm going to be their beloved leader. They love me, and uh, I just got to show it to them by force, or whatever. So let's look. So we got a good, good space to build out here. I'm going to stay on the top of the hill because it's going to be kind of like a fortified house, castle thing. Very small castle. I don't want to do anything too huge right here. Probably expand out into a, a dock or a harbor or something like that. Maybe have a mine over on in this hill area with some uh, wheat fields down here, some food, get some food growing. And then other miscellaneous builds elsewhere. And I think this is a pretty great place to start. Oh yeah, look, you can see them right over. Oh, there's just dirt. Yeah. All right, I'm going to get to work. All right, so I'm back. Um, I've got this laid out with wool. It's nothing fancy. Uh, but it, it should do well for us here. Um, so over here, we've got probably a workshop and a storage area. It's going to go there. Tower there, tower there, tower there. Little gatehouse, nothing too fancy. And then that's going to be my house with the kitchen on the bottom and my bedroom and living area up top. Um, I think I'm going to do this out of stone bricks, mix in some other bricks in there. Um, bottom of my house is going to be stone bricks. Uh, I'm going to come up into like a Tudor style thing with stripped of logs. Uh, there's my tree farm over there. And then there's my farm farm. I'm going to get that sorted out soon. All the animals I've been eating. And my little doggo that needs a name. I haven't quite figured it out. And then Dingus, the bird over there. I found him in that jungle over there. Anyway, I'm all over the place right now. But I'm going to get to building this, and I will see you in a bit. So I'm going to start off with one of the towers here. Still don't know how high I'm going to make it yet, but we're going to come in the corners here. Um, and then just go up until I decide that that's high enough. Leave a two or three block opening here tall and then come around like this and, uh, see the M from for marble there yep totally on purpose probably gonna vary the heights on these towers as well not too sure on that yet and then you can bring that Back over this way. Square it off again. Actually. Hold on. I don't have a pick. Something I gotta show everyone. Or get too far into that. My ADHD brain kicking in. Is. I have a donkey. His name is Jack. And um, I'm keeping him in this crack here. See where I'm going with this donkey crack? It's my donkey crack over here. Yeah, so turns out I'm not a fan of that roof, and this is definitely too short. Who are you? When did you get here? 
Now, what do you want? Don't take the attitude with me. You ain't got nothing I want. Sorry I gotta do this, bud. But you leave me no choice. Yeah, you better start running. Run. Yeah, so something still doesn't look right about it. Um... Ought to think on it. Hey. You too. Keep it down. Alright. No comments from the peanut gallery, please. Yeah, something just doesn't look right. Maybe that part hangs down too low. I don't know. It's just too broken up. It seems like. Also, maybe I can extend that a little bit. Huh. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep thinking about it. But for now, I'm just going to move on. It's going to be there. It's an eyesore. I get it. Just leave it be. Yeah, so that looks a lot better. Still going to think about it, but it's an improvement. These llamas have, like, something going on with their sinuses. I should take them to a vet. <laughs> but other than that, I'm going to get the walls built up, push the the turrets up, the, the towers up a bit. Maybe keep them low. We'll see. So check this out. I'm rowing my boat along. I'm looking for a desert because I need some glass. And I just wanted to explore. I got... Tired of building for a minute. It's taken a lot longer than I thought. There's a monument there. There's a monument probably a couple hundred blocks that way. And there's a freaking mushroom island. The the mushrooms. Unlimited mushroom stew. Let's go. Alright, another update. A uh, couple... Uh, so there's that Mushum Island, the other side of it. Here's my desert. So that's good news. Liking this seed. And a desert temple? Noise. Yo, this is the first proper lush cave I've seen. The ones that I've seen have been, um, like really small. Ow. This is pretty cool. I love it. This is really neat. Oh, an axolotl! I need a bucket. You bet your sweet tushy that I'm gonna steal that. Uh, give me that bucket. Where'd you go? Ah, you're mine now. That's awesome. This is so cool. Particle effects from the uh, the flowers on the ceiling. Found some moss blocks in a chest not too long ago. What can I get rid of here? Found some diamonds in that cave and a saddle, which is good. I want to pick up Oh, I don't have a shovel. You know what? I do now. I'm gonna use some of this iron I found, too. Let's see, what else can I get rid of? Let's get rid of those for now. I need to take a lot of stuff back. I'm probably not gonna bring... those books back because they're kind of kind of trash my theory was correct we have a badlands over there so terracotta for days let's go red sand too nice oh hey chicken don't uh don't go down there don't do it oh there he goes I said, oh no, there he goes. Go down the hole. <laughs> Get eaten by zombies. Humor me this one time, please. Might as well come by and check on the people of Orange Rufia. 
I don't even remember what I called this place, but they even have orange cats. They do love the color orange. Yeah, this is mine now. I do need this too. I'm back from my little trip to the desert. I didn't I haven't even put away all this stuff. My sweet, sweet loot. It's not put away yet even, but this is how it stands. The roof up here is starting to grow on me. Uh, this isn't roofed yet. I hate doing roofs. I'll, I'll come inside and show you. And then this is my living quarters. I got the towers. This one's a little shorter. I'm fine with that. You come in the workshop down here. I got the smelters. What can I throw in here? Probably all of it. Give me some of that iron. You know what? Yeah, let's let's cook up some sand for some glass and some clay. Nope. Some clay. Some more smooth stone going. The walls are real samey right now, but I'm going to go through and fix that before you see me again. Um, I'm, I gotta do the roofs and the detailing. This is my chest room. or storage. I'm gonna have... This isn't nearly enough for all the bulk storage I want. So what I'm thinking... is we're gonna be building a village. And then in each building... It's gonna serve a purpose. So we're gonna have like a stonemason. That has all the stone for bulk storage. Or... Uh, Lumberjack, like Forester kind of thing. He's going to have all the wood. Maybe a melon vendor that has, you know, an automated melon collector grower. That sort of thing. That's what I'm thinking of doing here. So it's going to be pretty awesome. That's it as it stands for right now. Just got to put the roofs on and detail everything. See, there's not really... The only thing I've got going on in here is a bed. I was going to extend this patio. You can call it that. But it just took up too much room. And then maybe... Like a doghouse over here. Or... Stables on the outside. Something like that. Tucked in here. I keep my animals inside. I haven't figured that out. Maybe a, an archery target range over here. It's going to look sweet when it's done, I promise. It looks really boring right now. <laughs> but it'll look great when, when it's done. Alright guys, it's uh, it's done. I cut a lot of it out, so you're probably like, what the heck is going on? But yeah, a lot of that footage was not usable because I'm incompetent and I have no idea what I'm doing. But here we go. We're going to take a quick tour. But first, um, you'll see I still got the, the simple field down here. I started terraforming over here. I don't know how I like it, but it looks a lot less flat. I got a lot of dirt because I terraformed around the, the entrance of the castle. I keep calling it a castle. I don't, I'm not sure what to call it. So I'm just going to keep it a castle. Um, I've been slowly eating them and breeding breeding the animals but i got a lot of sheep way too many i'm gonna have to thin the herd same with pigs cows i need their leather but anyway so as we walk up to the castle here the gatehouse i completely changed the roof to match the rest of the roofs that i did i think this one i pushed up a couple blocks taller uh, we have some some foliage and leaves kind of coming around the entire outside of the the building here. Some stones on the ground, torches for lighting. I haven't figured out my lighting situation yet. Little little button that does nothing except looks like a rock. <laughs> but as you can see, this green goes around the back side of the top of my house, inside of my house. More rocks. Uh, we got shutters on all the windows. Really, that's what it's supposed to look like. It's it's uneven. There's one extra shutter. 
but I couldn't stand it being off. Just add an extra shutter there just to make it symmetrical. Uh, occasionally I'll have some fence gates holding up these plants because it looks nice. <laughs> I don't I don't know why they're there, but they look like they're supposed to be there in in my opinion. Uh, this tower is shorter than the other ones. I couldn't be bothered to, <laughs> to raise it a bit, but it gives us some height variation. More rocks, more shutters on the back side of my workshop here. We're back around to the front. Uh, you can see I went with the just simple wooden roof. The roofs here, um, they're outlined in, in dark oak, and then the bulk of it, majority of it is spruce. So we walk in, we have a well. It's uncovered, but it's an infinite water source, actually. So that's sweet. I just waterlog these half slabs. Um, over here, you know, it it's nice. It's green. You'll see a lot of these armor stands around. I'm, eventually I'm going to make them look like um, guards or something. Just standing around. Make it look like I have a posse. But I have to use sticks because I'm not that cool, I guess. Come up here. You know, nothing special in here. Ignore that path block under there. Come up here we can... We have access to the gatehouse with some more of my friends that I made. <laughs> no entrance into here. We'll be going in here in a minute. Come up here top of my gatehouse we got just stripped logs and it looks like chains that would be pulling up the big gate the port colis as it as it were so that's pretty sweet except you know putting a ladder in a one wide hallway is not the greatest idea it's getting nighttime and then a place to practice archery if if you wanted to. <laughs> the walkways go all around, so doors here, door there. You can even access it there and walk up there. I'm gonna come in my house because I gotta sleep. So we come in, we got a place for the dog with his favorite things, his leash for walkies and his bone. Some plants and a pot. A kitchen. I love piston tables. Just a powered piston and a trap door on the side. It looks really nice as a table. And then just a simple kitchen. Nothing really to write home about, but it fills the space and it does the job. I'm pretty sure, yeah, I've got potatoes cooking. Uh, raw foods here and then cooked here. There's nothing there because I keep eating meat. So we come up here, you see my bed. Uh, it's It's got a cover on it. I used banners. It's kind of like the curtains for the bed. I got a closet with, for chess and some armor stands for my armor. A simple desk. Walk out here for no reason because you'll instantly fall off and break an ankle. A chair to sit in to put my shoes on or whatever. I got Dingus hiding up there. It just makes noise. I try to get him to sit on the edge, but it's hard to get a parrot where you want it. When we come up to the bed, you can see the dog. He doesn't want to sleep in his spot, so he takes up most of my bed. A giant, giant bed. <laughs> Alright, now it's daytime. Oh, and a clock on the wall. I forgot I put those there. Uh, eventually, I'm going to get these all colored. I was just running out of red wool. Come downstairs. We, we have the workshop. Grindstone there, an anvil there. A stone cutter. More places to uh, cook, cook things, smelt iron, make charcoal. Look out the windows. Come upstairs, and then you have my very unorganized storage solution for right now. I'm really unorganized right now. <laughs> I get it. 
but it, that'll be fixed soon. Come down here. And here's my horse. Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. I have another horse running around here somewhere. I didn't like him, so I let him loose. I think he's over there. And then just the ominous banner that I know nothing to do with. And my tree farm. So I've been up to. It took a lot longer and it is very ambitious for a starter house. Let's see, we're on day, where'd it go? Sh shouldn't there be like a day counter in here somewhere? Yeah, day 83, I found it. <laughs> Almost 100 days and I finally finished my starter house. But uh, you gotta go big or go home. And I really like how it came out. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Sorry this one took so long to get out, but it was a big project. And I think next time I'm going to start working on a mine because I need to get diamonds. I'm tired of running out of iron picks every 30 seconds. So yeah, there you guys go. Hope you enjoyed and like, comment, dislike it, whatever you got to do to voice your... Um, Opinions, displeasure. <laughs> Alright, thanks so much for watching. Peace.